It's day two here in Saskatchewan. It snowed and it's gotten a lot colder than, than it was the first day. I like this spot. We're way back in here, probably 30, well, maybe 40 miles back in the bush, so it's a pretty neat spot. All you can do is try. We wanted. Yeah, baby. It pays to be patient here in Saskatchewan. Because we were after that buck. My first buck with my Matthews Creed. It sent one perfect through the boiler room. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Right here it is. Arrow land right there. He's laying right over here. 15 yards is all he went. He is smoked. He's right here, Brian. Look at him. He's a mega giant. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, he is a monster. Look at his mass. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is the buck we waited for. I cannot believe it. I am actually in shock right now. I mean, we went for broke on this deal because we have had some bad luck actually all year. It's been a tough season for the driven crew and I was starting to question my sanity, especially after yesterday we had that big 10 come in in the same spot. Looked over at my cameraman, he said, are you crazy? And uh, I said, hey, this is a buck we were wanting target and I, I knew that he might slip up. I was just hoping I wasn't going to run out of time because it is my last day here. It's the biggest deer that I've ever shot and probably ever will shoot and it's just tremendous, tremendous mass. Look at the mass. He's going to score good. I mean, just because he's so big, I mean, it actually makes his rack look a little bit small, but it isn't. It's just a giant. I mean, and he is just huge. First, buck with my Matthews Creed and it put it on him. It smoked him. And I got a monster to take home. Wow. <laughs> 